What's going on, people? I'm here to do another debunking type video. Um, there's a lot of professional paranormal investigators, and yes, they call themselves professional paranormal investigators, and I catch them doing this all the time within their pictures. Mainly, it's mainly in pictures, but it does happen in video too. And honestly, it has happened to me, but obviously you've never seen it in any of the footage because I cut it out because it has nothing to do with the paranormal. So. I'm going to show you these, what these professional paranormal investigators do on hopefully mistake. Because um, if they do it on purpose, then that's pretty shitty on them. Um, this is going to be a two-part video. First one is going to be videos, and then I have to wait until uh, November, December to film the photo one. So let's take a look at some of these that I have filmed personally. This is just the film version, indoors and outdoors. So. We'll see what these professional paranormal investigators do on other accent or purpose, so. Hello? Okay. Now, we just seen outside. Now, I want to explain something to you. Say, say this wasn't me, and this was, I'm another paranormal investigation team. They could say, well, it was 90 degrees outside, there was no wind, nothing, and that just mist appeared and went over my camera. Well, okay. Now let's look at the footage. Now if you look at the footage, it looks like a normal night. It doesn't look cold. There doesn't seem to be, you know, any wind or anything. But in reality, it was middle of winter, and there was snow covering the entire ground. For some reason, the camcorder just didn't pick it up. So, people could say whatever the fuck they want to say, and the viewer is kind of stuck believing it. So, that was a very, very cool thing that that picked up, that it didn't look like winter, but yet it still was. Um... So you gotta question every paranormal video that you watch. That's a must. You must question every paranormal video you watch. Alright, now let's take a look in the inside. And it still happens inside too, so let's take a look here. And that you keep seeing it's not a fucking manifestation. It's my breath. So I'll get this shit twisted. This shit with one hand. Let's get a spirit box. This is where I got that uh, stationary orb. Spare box then, or the the K2. Okay, you just saw the mist from the inside of the building as well. So it can still happen inside. It doesn't have to be just outside. So uh, come on, people, get your shit together. I see this in photos and videos all the fucking time. Get your shit together. Edit these clips out because it's not paranormal. You just make yourself look like a jackass if you claim it's paranormal. When all you have to do is watch this video and I magically have the same apparition that you had in your video. It's bullshit. Fix your shit. Don't be posting that bullshit online or on television. Get your shit together. You're not fucking paranormal investigators if you post that type of shit. So, I hope this video was uh, inform informative. Uh, and there's going to be a photo version. I'm actually very looking forward to the photo version because I know I'm going to be able to do some really cool shit. So, uh, see you guys in November or December for the uh, photo version. So, hope you guys enjoyed.